A person that is not on learning and relearning is not undergoing Bible teaching. There's no way you will go through Bible teaching and not unlearn to relearn. Are you understanding? For example, how many of you know clapping in church is not doctrine? No, no, I'm serious. Clapping is not doctrine. Who are you clapping for? He said, clap for Jesus. How can you clap for Jesus? You clap for Jesus, you clap for yourself, you clap for your uncle, you clap for your president, and you're clapping for, are they mates? In the Bible, when he says clap, he's actually saying mock the people. Clapping is for mockery. That's why in the New Testament, there's no teaching on clapping. Not in Acts, neither in the epistles. So how do we worship God in the New Testament? We lift up holy hands without doubt and rot in our hands, in our hearts. That's how we worship God. We clap for us if we like because we all agree that clapping for us here within this community is to celebrate you. So we can clap because we have an understanding that is common among us. But when it comes to God, we relate with God doctrinally. And what is the doctrine for exalting and celebrating God? We lift up holy hands. Are you following what I'm teaching? But when you are not taught, you will still be clapping. Say, let's celebrate God's goodness. Bah, 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 bah. What is wrong with you? We have said the only way we celebrate God's goodness is by what? Lifting above. Your default setting will not allow you to make the adjustment because you are not learning. Because if you were learning, you will know that we don't clap for Jesus. We wave in honor. You don't worship God on your terms. You worship God on his terms. You're not the recipient of it. He is the recipient. And he has told you how to do it for him to enjoy it. I don't know if I'm communicating at all. So, so but since I've been a Christian, we've been clapping. That's your problem. You've been a Christian for too long to learn new things. We all used to clap. I clap more than all of you here. I'm very sure of that. <laughs> And we clapped with a degree of expertise when we hit our hands. <laughs> Where I'm coming from, we didn't have musical equipment, so our instrumentation was our hands. And we had a rhythm with which we clap, such that you will be dancing whether you like it or not. But when the scriptures came alive, I unlearned and relearned. And I'm not clapping for Jesus anymore. If I go to a church where they don't know these truths and they are clapping, I don't get angry. While they are clapping, I'm lifting my hand because we are not the same. I won't do what they are doing because they are doing it. I will do what I'm doing because I know that what I'm doing is the right thing. And I'm not going to condemn them for clapping because they are in ignorance. And because they are in ignorance, God overlooks. But one of the time, I teach them. And after teaching them, if they clap again, God will not overlook. Because now they are being rebellious. Because they already know. <laughs> are we teaching good? Yes. 